Thank you, Mr. Speaker. My constituents in Edmonton eligibly know our government's budget invests in stabilizing and maintaining the services Albertans depend on, rather than making reckless cuts that will only make things worse for Albertans most vulnerable. Given our government's commitment to supporting the safety, dignity, and well-being of persons with disabilities, to the Minister of Human Services, how is our government invested in the assured income for the severely handicapped program in Budget 2016? Minister of Human Services. Thank you, Mr. Speaker, and thank you to the member for the question. Our government believes that all Albertans should be able to live in a stable home and be able to put food on the table. That's why, despite challenging economic time, Budget 2016 maintains its benefit level with a targeted funding increase of $28.3 million. Families receiving ish may also be eligible for Alberta Child Benefit which is for a single parent of uh, two children can receive maximum of $1,650. First supplemental. <laughs> thank you, Mr. Speaker, and thank you to the Minister. Given that I've had several constituents whom are age recipients connect with me about the program, and given that I've heard concerns from some of them about the av ability of age workers to manage growing caseloads, again to the Minister of Human Services, what is our government doing in order to make case workers more accessible to those that depend on age? Honourable Minister. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you, Mr. Speaker, and again to the member for the question. In tough economic times like these, even more people need supports, and that's why we have increased the funding to age to accommodate increased demand. The age caseload increase is by upward of 1,500 clients per year. And our government has invested additional $28.3 million to address growing caseload and increase in cost per case. Thank you. Second supplemental. Thank you, Mr. Speaker, and again to the Minister. Given that age recipients depend on this funding to pay for their housing, food, and other basic needs, what is being done to better streamline services so age recipients receive the supports they need when they need them? Minister. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Overall, there are uh, 54,000 adults with disabilities receiving support from the ISH program, and our government is committed to ensuring that these Albertans receives, receive the support they need, and ISH applica application wait times have been reduced uh, through improved and centralized processes in the ISH program. In addition, uh, each applicant can seek short-term assistance through Alberta Work Income Support programs. Uh, I will continue uh, to work uh, with my officials to find ways to further reduce the weight. Honourable Minister, 